Welcome to this quick video on moving columns and rows in Microsoft Excel. So there is a few different ways that you can move your columns and your rows around if they're in the wrong order, if you want to change them around. Uh, you can use things like cut and insert and paste and things like that and all those shortcuts. But there's actually a super easy way just to move it around by remembering to press a button. So let's have a look at my columns. At the end, I have an order date column. And what I wanna do is I'm gonna click on that column and I want to move that next to the order number. So I want the order amount to be the last column on my spreadsheet. So when I do this, what I need to do is click on that column and then move over to the left hand side and you'll see my cursor's now moved. It's moved from a plus sign, it's now a hand. Now I'm on a Mac, if you're on a PC, you might see a plus sign with arrows at each of the ends. And what you wanna do is hold down the shift button. When you hold down the shift button, what you can do, and you might not see it very, very well, but you, as I move it across, you'll see the each of the lines start to change a little bit. It looks a little bit green. You can see it more down at the bottom. And that means it's mo moving that side of the column to that place. So if I wanted it after the full name, I'd go right across, but I just want it after the order number. So you can see that line creeps down between column D and column E. And if I drop, then what's happened is my order date has now moved over and is now column E instead of column F. So you just need to remember to click on that column, hover over the left hand side where it changes to either a hand or a plus sign with arrows at each of the ends. And then as you hold down shift, click and move, and then you can just see the line moving. And as you, as soon as you drop, as soon as you let go of your mouse, then that column will be there where you expect it to be. Works exactly the same way with rows. So if I click on a row to move around um, and hover over the bottom, hold down shift and move it down, you can see the, the, the lines moving. It's easier to see in the columns on the far right of the screen, but you can see the lines moving and I can then move Mary to wherever I want her to be just by letting go of shift and my mouse. So really quick and easy rather than having to mess around adding new rows and columns and then deleting them if you need to, I tend to just use shift and then move my columns and rows around in Microsoft Excel. So have a go at that one. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel and let me know what videos you'd like me to record next.